Welcome to this week's Chinook News! Good morning, Clackamas River. We are so excited to be back with you on a virtual assembly. We hope you have had a wonderful week of school. We have some morning announcements for you. Yes, we do. All right, Miss Anderson. So we have been focusing on respect in the month of November. Mm -hmm. And guess what? We get to continue that focus on respect and we will be nominating students at our live assembly that will be coming up here shortly. So continue to show respect and kindness throughout our building because we're still building those kindness chains. So let's keep up that great work with respect. Awesome. And also happening on the very last Thursday before we go to winter break, we have the high school band. Uh, if you were here last year, this is a really fun event where they come over and we get a chance to sing some Christmas carols and just enjoy them playing music and singing with us. So looking forward to both of those things on December 15th. 15th is going to be a busy and a fun, fun day for everyone. Mm -hmm. All right, Miss Anderson, just a quick update here. And we do have Read Day this Friday, mm -hmm. okay? But coming up on December 9th, we do not have a read day. So students will not be coming to school on that read day on December 9th. December 16th, 16th, we do have a read day. So we go read day, no read day, read day. Kind of like a pattern there. Mm -hmm. And uh, something really exciting is happening today. Did you know that in the history of Estacada High School, we had never had a state football championship? Wow, I did not know that. Never. So, we are so excited that our football players were able to battle their way all the way from their regular season. Um, and last Saturday, they won that state title. So later today, we are going to be lining up the halls of our building and they are going to have a parade for us. So we are really looking forward to showing them how much we appreciate the hard work that goes into being a student athlete. Um, in order to do that, you have to keep your grades up. You have to go to practice every day. You have to be a part of a team. Sometimes that means that you have to do things you don't want to do to Very help true. the team. So all those characteristics that we look for, we're so proud of our boys who are able to uh, not only participate in a team, but work so well together that they brought home the state title. Good job, Rangers. Way to go, Rangers. All right, and we are far away from this, but we just want to give a quick heads up that after winter break, there is no school on that January 2nd, which is that Monday. So that week will look a little different. We will have school Tuesday through Friday, and that will be January 3rd through the 6th. All right, well, those are the announcements that we have for you guys today, but we definitely want to celebrate some birthdays. birthdays. So, happy birthday to you. So, earlier this week, Miss Krieger had her birthday. So, if you see her, make sure you say happy belated birthday. And then, we also have a list of students who will be celebrating this week. We have Bo in second grade Oberg and Lillian in second grade Johnson. Carl in fourth grade French, Alice in first grade Weller, Mia in Miss Arnett's fifth grade class, and Brandon in Miss French's fourth grade, Aiden in Miss O'Connor's fifth grade, and Judd in Miss Hill's first grade, Samantha in Miss Clayton's kindergarten, and Destiny in Miss Munn's second grade. Happy birthday to you all! Awesome. Happy, happy birthdays. Now we have the golden book, golden plunger, and golden tray. All right, Chinooks, this week for that golden book, Miss Rutherford's class one. Woo! Awesome, that's a new one that we just started. So we're excited to see how many of you are really taking on that challenge and showing us your best library behavior. Our golden plunger Ooh. went to... Our kinder and first grade boys. Nice work in that bathroom, keeping it clean and following all of those expectations. All right, and how about that tray? Ooh, that tray was a hard one this week. It was a tough battle between keeping the cafeteria clean and following those expectations. Everyone was doing an amazing job, but this week, our first grade students are taking that golden tray. Nice work. Awesome. And Miss Anderson, just yeah. to let you know, 
First grade is in the lead on our chart for having the most golden trays so far. That's pretty awesome. And you know what? Sometimes it can be hard to remember how you do things after being gone for a week and a half. So thank you for jumping right back in and showing us that you know what it looks like to be a Chinook. All right, next, Miss Anderson, we have trivia. And we didn't have any trivia last week because it was Thanksgiving break. Uh, but what we do have is some new trivia. So for our kinder through second grade, check out your trivia right here. And for our third and fifth, here is your new trivia. Check it out. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, we hope that we see a lot of you back here tomorrow for Read Day. We hope that you have a wonderful weekend with your family and friends, and we will see you back on campus on Monday.